Well, this got up. Took the dog out. About 54 degrees out there. Kind of, I don't know, partly cloudy, I guess, would be the best way to describe it. Not sure what the weather's supposed to be today. Hopefully going to run a few errands with Mom here this morning. And then, of course, a little chit-chat with the fiancé this afternoon. No other real big plans besides that. Though I do got to shave in sometime here pretty soon. Starting to get awful scruffy looking. Got to do that. So maybe I'll get that done today. We'll see how the day goes. We'll see how it progresses. It's a brand new week. Last day of January, I believe, today is, isn't it? Yeah. So, I was supposed to be having eye treatment today, but, uh, of course, they moved it up a week, so that'll be next week. <sighs> good times, good times. Anyway, I hope you had a good weekend, and uh, I hope your upcoming week is wonderful. So, let's head her down the road here, guys, and see what happens. Hey, guys. Well, been to a couple of stores. Just got done at Sweet Bay. I uh, got some stuff for salads. I'm going to do two salads today, chef salads and uh, see how that works for me. I, uh, I've got to get some weight off. My leg is killing me. Remember I mentioned it a little while ago there that I hurt my leg and stepped just wrong? Well, it is just killing me today. It's like somebody just beat the back of my calf muscle with a bat. I'm not happy. It seems like it's always something, huh? Anyway, I'm gonna do two salads today. See if I can start this week off with a better. I got uh, just under five weeks to uh, Lose some weight before the fiance gets here, and hopefully my leg is gonna feel better by then. Jumping Jehoshaphat, it is really bothering me. I'll go home, and take some aspirin. Hopefully that'll help. But geez, I gotta do a lot of walking and stuff when she gets here. It seems like the harder I try to lose weight and get in shape, the the more things fall apart. I don't know. Anyway, we'll try. Salad will be good. Got lots of vegetables, and I got some ham and turkey to chop up and throw in. So I have like a chef salad. Got myself a low sugar dressing and should be pretty good at least I'm hopeful anyway and uh, got myself some uh, diet iced tea to have that was made with sucrose not uh, aspartame and uh, yeah that'll be that'll be pretty decent anyway two salads I mean I'm sure I'll be a little bit hungry but uh, you know I gotta do what you gotta do to lose the weight so time to get more serious about it just waiting for mom to get out and then we're gonna head down the road and stop at uh, save a lot for bananas and water I think um, I think, yeah. So, then we'll head home and uh, I'll have to give the fiance a little call and see what time she wants to do a video chat today. It's warmed up quite nice out here. It's real kind of glary. I got to put my sunglasses on. My eyes are starting to water. Ah, I like getting out and getting some fresh air anyway. Nice to get out, as you can see. It's a beautiful day out here. A couple of clouds, but not bad. Warm, very warm. To switch the shorts here pretty soon I think but that's all right that's what the great thing about living in Florida is it's warm in January it's probably oh gosh I'd say it's probably at least 70 out here yeah it's getting pretty warm good times good times guys well guys just about 12:30. had an incredibly good salad for lunch it was huge lots of vegetables a little ham and turkey and some cheese thrown in oh it was great and we chopped up the stuff to make the salad with, and there was enough left for me to have my salad later. So I'll have a nice salad later with some TV. Oh, good, good, very tasty. It's gorgeous outside right now. It is 75 degrees. Nice breeze. So I think after I chat with the fiance, I'm going to sit out back with my dog for a little while and just uh, enjoy the nice warm weather. I can't believe this. Last day of January and it's 75 degrees. Yeah. You wouldn't get that in Maine. Actually, I hear they get more snow in Maine, so... To all the family up in Maine, I feel bad for you. I feel bad you're not down here enjoying the great weather with me. <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to do a little surfing here before I talk to the fiancé, catch up on some videos, and uh, see what else comes my way. Just had a 40-minute chat with the fiancé. She had to get a lot of stuff done. She got to do some teaching. She's got to go to a couple of doctor visits tomorrow to make sure she's all good for flying. And she's got to check out some stuff. And then she's mailing me some of her paperwork just in case. So she's got a busy day tomorrow. So she was headed to bed early to get some rest. Hopefully it all goes well for her. Uh, it is warmed up to a beautiful 77 degrees here. So we we'll had to step out back here with the dog, I think, and get a little fresh air here pretty soon. I got a a load of YouTube videos to watch. Holy cow. I was caught up last night when we went to bed. <laughs> so I got to do a few of those too. But I'll get a little fresh air. And then hopefully after my salad tonight, once the sun goes down, maybe I'll get a walk around the park. It's about a mile. With my leg bothering me, I don't want to do the two or three mile one. I, I want to kind of 
but I got to do something, you know, I got to do some physical activity, so I'll go out and at least get a mile, mile walk around, it'll be cooler, and I'll put the MP3 player on, and if I'm feeling, feeling the legs okay, I may try to do the two mile, but I'm really going to play it easy, because I want my leg to be good, and I got to get myself ready for when the fiancé shows up, because we'll be doing a lot of walking and stuff then, so, good times, good times. Well, I was going to sit outside a little this afternoon, but I think I'll wait till the sun goes down and watch the sunset. The good thing is, Hang 'em High with Clint Eastwood's on. Oh my god, I love that movie. And of course, any westerns are good movies, but the ones with Clint Eastwood, come on. That's a classic. Looks like it's getting to be a better day all the time. What do we got here? Headlights. Taillights. I'm going to put them on the trike for my mom. And what's this? That's right, the sun is setting. I'm outside with a dog. I was watching uh, Clint Eastwood, but got to get the bike done before it gets too dark. Plus, I want to see the sunset. <sighs> Having a pretty good day, to be honest with you. Things have gone well. Can't complain. Yep, still haven't done my salad for dinner. Gonna do that here in a little while. But now we're gonna see if we can get this tail light and headlight installed. Let's get her done. And there you go. One tail light installed. One headlight installed. The headlight's got two settings, flashing and steady. And then the tail light's got like six or seven different rotating ones because it's got LEDs. It's quite a nice tail light actually. So there you go. Mom's trike's all set. Ready for nighttime riding. And how's that sun looking? Oh, she's really setting pretty good. Ah, uh, yes. Some clouds have rolled in, so. Probably won't be quite as spectacular as I was thinking it would be, but hey, it's still 73, 74 degrees out. Nothing wrong with that. Anyway, guys, check out the uh, bucket down below. I've got two or three new subscribers. Their links are there. Check those out. And, of course, follow me on Twitter. And, of course, i got a list of some really good folks down below. you really got to check those out if you haven't done that already. Thank you so much for your comments. Thumbs ups, I appreciate it. The more the better. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, I'm up at 287 subscribers, thereabouts. So we're getting there. 200 is not too far away. Alright, guys, I hope this uh, Monday was good for you. Hope the rest of the week is. Thank you for stopping by. And uh, I'll definitely be back here tomorrow. Remember to enjoy every day. The good Lord sends your way.